How are we doing, Rich? I'm Jason. And of course, Spring about Wargaming, and what a game we have in store for you. <laughs> so, okay. Jace has taken on, <clears throat> taken over using the nids because yeah. he wants me to suffer the event table, which we've done. Uh, but we'll do that when we we'll talk about that when we actually do the deployment. We filmed the arm of this, uh, we've already deployed, so we're ready to go. Um, because this was new and Jace didn't really know with the nids, so we rolled for the mission and Jace got terrorized. Uh, so every time I fail a terror, break, or fear test, um, he gets a victory point. Yeah, it's a bit hard against Marines, but it's only one above the average on 2d6. On top of that, because he knew, uh, or I knew what mission he's got, because we normally keep it a secret, but he kind of needs to know, or I need to know because I use it as normally. Uh, he knows what mission I got, uh, we don't normally do it this way. So I've got Engage and Destroy, which I was lucky. <laughs> So I've got to wipe out units. So he knows he can always hide one or two models to give back to rob me on victory points, which he will do. It'll just come straight forward. Uh, so i have done the army list for Jace and i done the points and I went, that's a lot of models. Done the points again. That's still a lot of models. Done the points again. And yeah, it's a lot of models because it worked out while he was deploying. Um, Getting rid of three Tyranid Warriors with Bone Swords and Hardened Carapace is 195 points, and that gives you a lot of troops. That's a lot of troops. Yeah. The other thing is what you'll hear is us waffling on in the army list. Um, we discussed it while I was filming the army list. Uh, we've made a slight change to mine. I was uh, one point under because I gave my commander a bolter, and then when we turned up, I'd done my war gear and gave him a combi weapon. Um, for 10 points, which freed up three points. So I was four points under, which then gave my uh, death company and my assault marine with a power fist a chainsaw. Yeah. So that's what's happened now. So uh, my death company can't parry anyway, can they? They're frenzy. So it's irrelevant. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, well, doesn't matter. Uh, but my normal assault marine squad with a power fist does have a chainsaw. So there we go. Yeah, technically, you don't need to give them chainswords either. So I could have saved myself two, four, six, eight, ten points. Yeah. Using an extra weapon, they didn't come back. You know, what do I get for ten points? Don't. No, you don't. Know. You need a sword to so you have two attacks, an extra attack. Yeah, so it's worth it. Mm. Uh, so you that's it. You can pistol, but they can't. Yeah. No, bolt pistol. Yeah. Right, so we'll do uh, uh, the army lists coming up, and what we're doing is uh, with the Blood Angels, I'm going to superimpose some nicely painted, uh, nice photos of some nicely painted models because obviously this is the army that Danny from, let me get this right, Nostalgia Hammer is his YouTube channel, but Cauldron of Paint is his um, painting. painting company so these models that you're going to see for the blood angels were painted by danny they're at the low level apart from the characters they've been given a bit more upper level i think danny does bronze silver and gold the characters are uh, i think around gold level uh, silver gold level um but they're not um what's he do he does uh dar armor pieces mm. as well they're not to that level uh, and the rest of the troops the bikes the dev company all that sort of stuff are all at his lowest yeah. bronze level or tabletop level so uh, enjoy the photos because they are fantastic they look mm, amazing um, and i hope to do them justice <laughs> ignore the nids because <laughs> <laughs> they were painted by me with contrast right <laughs> okay there will be no close-ups of them <laughs> so are you ready yeah ready. Okay, let's go okay so this is my 1500 point army well yeah, about 1,500 points, 1,497, something like that. So this is Captain Danny, and he's got a combi weapon, which is a bolter and melter gun. I can fire both at the same time at minus one if I want to, and being a space being you can rapid fire with a bolter, so that's cool. But because it's minus one, I've actually given him a bionic eye, so he's plus one to hit anyway. And on top of that, he can detect hidden troops within 24, but obviously, uh, I think it's a special rule which I'll have to look up against lictors. On top of that, the classic um, conversion field, uh, unprotected troops get blinded on a four, five, or six and have a minus, um, a weapon skill of one. So that might come in handy, we don't know. 
We've also then got chapter, uh, the chapter chaplain Simon. He's got a jump pack, so we can keep up with the uh, death coming. He's got his Crozier Sakurin, um for his weapon, and he's got his uh, four plus save as well. But to make him look uh, cool, he's uh, he hasn't got it obviously because these models never came with it. But he's got a Storm Shield War Gear card as well, so you can imagine him jumping in, blocking with the shield because the Crozier Sakurin and cousin can't parry. But the storm shield does so it does make him reasonably hard he's a hero so he's uh like a second level so he's got two wounds and he's going to be leading the death company and there's five of them four of them have got chain swords and bolt pistols and one of them's got a bolt pistol and a power fist i've also got then a tactical squad which i'm going to break down into two five-man squads uh, one will have the melter gun and the other one will have the last cannon and the rest have all got bolters and frag grenades. I then also have a 10 man devastator squad which again will be broken down into two five man combat squads. Uh, each with two heavy bolters and the heavy bolters have all got hellfire shells which means they wound anything on a two plus if I fire a single shot. But if it goes through at minus two safe, it's D6 wounds. So if I'm lucky, I could really hurt a Carnifix or a Hive Tyrant. On top of that, we have got a combat squad, an actual combat squad from White Dwarf 207. Uh, they've got three of them. I've got chain swords and bolt pistols. One, the leader there, has got a bolt pistol and power fist. I generally didn't have the points to... Um... Having said that, I might have. Chainsaw. Yeah, because if I drop, I've given, I'll do this off camera, uh, and I'll do it now while, you, while you're listening. Uh, if I drop the bolter on Captain Danny, which yeah. is three points, I can give him a chainsaw. Yeah, because you've got a combi weapon. I've you? got the combi weapon instead, yeah. So there you go, right update on the list, Chase don't mind. So that command, that squad leader now has a chainsaw and power fist with the bolt pistol. You were under points anyway. No, I, I was a, I was one point under with the bolter. For him so then on top of that we've got three standard bikes uh even though that model does have uh, a melter gun on it i don't it's just three standard uh bikes with twin leak bolters and they've all got bolt pistols as well so that is my army um and the mission i got because jace knows it already is engage and destroy Okay, Jace has asked me to do this one because he actually doesn't know what he's got. So he has got two units, or broods I should say, of six gargoyles each, which of course can fly high as well. He then has, look at the monsters in the middle here. Uh, there's one. There's the other. So he's got two lictors, basic, there's nothing special about them, apart from they are nasty. One hive tyrant with a venom cannon and bone sword, doesn't have a lash whip. Biomorphs, he's got optic membranes, which gives him a two plus save against being blinded. He's got um, a two plus save on, on 1d6, so he's got two plus save. And he's also got a four plus voltage field, an invulnerable save, which of course can burn out any field. So it can burn out my storm shield, my rosier, or my conversion field. Behind him, <laughs> I gave Jace the options he wanted them to be tough. They've both got voltage field, so uh, they've got a four plus invun save, which again can burn burn out voltage fields, uh, burn out fields. Uh, we've had a discussion like a house rule. We're not going to give them toughness nine because it just makes them too tough, and we're not giving to give them the two plus save because that is genuinely two plus on two d six, and again that's overkill. We then have. Three warriors with death speeders, and they do have a two plus save on 1d6 because they've got hardened carapace. And then, not one, not two, not three, but four units of ten. Oh my god, hormigons. So, all that lot is going to be rushing towards my line as well as this lot hit wobbly camera there, as well as a lot of this hidden just outside my deployment zone, and then these bad boys are gonna deep strike down and torch the crap at me. This will be a nasty game, and I ain't looking forward to it, and for the first time ever, 
I am suffering the event table. Okay, guys, here we are then. So I'm deployed. I deployed after Jace. Uh, so I put my death company here to hold this flank here. I've got a devastated unit in here, which draws the line of sight up through the ruins once he enters it. Uh, and then I've got a tactical squad here, uh, just so they can get the last cannon to uh, fire at the carnifixes as they come through. I then got this close assault unit here. I've got Captain Danny there and the Chaplain Simons over there with the death company. I have a devastated unit here. The bikes have gone on the flank march, and this squad got put into reserve because they're all around us. So, how did Jace do with the rolls? Well, I got away quite lightly. The chaplain, Chaplain Simon there, he hates them, hates them, hates them with a passion. Um, sadly, my other close assault unit, Fear them, they've had enough. They've seen too much bloodshed. They just can't take no more and their nerves are about to break, which is why Captain Danny's there. The bikes went on a flank march, but must have driven through a spore cloud or something happened while they stopped for a pee break. Because <laughs> one of them's acting a little bit strange, which I don't need. <laughs> so I got away with it kind of lightly. Trouble is, with them fearing everything, and Jace has got terrorised, that works right into Jason's um, thing. I will make a note, though, that he did roll a four on the death company because they have their immune psychology, so that was lucky. We have two hidden lictors here. And then we've got uh, Hormigrants, Warriors, Carnifix, and Gargoyles over there to support this... Uh, attack here and then over here we've got the main part of the swarm we've got 30 hormigons the carnifix high turret nestled behind don't blame him and the gargoyles there as well and i do believe the gargoyles will fly high and come down and torch me as is what they're meant to do unless he decides to fly them and it's minus two to hit and i've got to shoot them because i've got to shoot the closest monsters so sadly here we go we're going to roll for first turn if i get a one i could be buggered oh i've won you can't beat it Right, so I'm gonna go first. <laughs> we'll just come back after my movement phase. Good luck, mate. Here we go. <laughs> okay, here we go, turn one. Uh, movement phase really didn't happen. A lot of this, this whole flank has gone into Overwatch, literally because of those two. Uh, these guys have gone into Overwatch because I can't really see anything, but these guys, the crazy little buggers that they are, have jumped forward. He scattered out of the terrain. They all landed. Oh, that's the point. They all landed, didn't they? Yeah. So they landed in the uh, oh, right. yeah. terrain. So those three got dice. No. So one of them's got to take a save. Uh, yeah. uh, no. Strength five. Uh, strength three. So that's five to wound. Three plus save. Saved it. And the chaplain. Nope, he's okay. So with difficult with jump packs, if you land in difficult training, we've classed this as difficult terrain. Although we don't class the movement for it. Because no, if it's difficult really, terrain, yeah. then it should be more half your move. But it does say hard objects, so yeah. I'd say you're trying to land in the crater there. Um, yeah, we need, to imp imp we need to put in difficult terrain, I think, sometimes with these games. Because, like I say, this is completely open for you. Yeah. For the nids. It's, it's a bit of a daft, you, not... daft rule there. But it would slow you down. I have a lot because you can only run half your movement. So they've jumped in there. Uh, and he scattered up there, so he made his save. He didn't land, uh, and they all sort of got hurt and survived. The armor took it. The reason I've done that is because bolt pistols got a range of 16, so I'm hoping to get a few snapshots off on them. Otherwise, nothing else is moving because, of course, those two have hampered me up, and I can't see anything at the moment because the rules of the train, which we'll cover it while we're here now, if you're in it within the wall section, including the outside here. Uh, <clears throat> you can see through there, but we're saying this sort of stuff, it's all covered in rubble and stuff like that, so you can't see through, so I couldn't draw a line of sight through that there. Whilst you're in the ruins, it's minus two to be shot at. Um, shooting over any terrain like this, I think if you're a normal sized creature, it'd be minus a uh, scatter terrain, do you want to make it minus one? Yeah. Uh, kind of fixes monstrous creatures won't benefit from that, but they will in the buildings. Uh, this is going to be impassable. These two here are just for decal. We're trying to protect it because we need these to fire at the hive ships up in space later on. That's what we're trying to do is kind of hold the line here, destroy this force and get the generator started on there. 
but that's that's where I am with the movement phase so I'm gonna pass this over to Jay so I can do a bit of shooting and that will be my turn one done right so if this has worked I should get range of 16 out ooh, out ooh, out oh this is not working well oh no he's out as well one shot <laughs> make it count hits, hits. Doesn't work. Oh. Well, we know they got a range of 18, <laughs> so that's going to be fun. Yeah, but not many will be in, mate, because you were out with quite a few of yours. Yeah, but not only that, <coughs> is you haven't got um, your charging in the terrain. Yeah. So I get to go first. So that's that's my turn, mate. <laughs> right, I'll um, pause this and I can pass it back. Right, so just, con just to confirm what Jace does his movement, well, if Jace charges them, the class has been a defender of school, which negates the charge, but Jace will have extra models, so one of them will get uh, plus one attack. Uh, so that's that there. They are frenzied, so they will have three attacks apiece, but let's see what he does. Right, so... When, when he, if he moves the lictors, we'll come back to that. If I have to interrupt with any shooting, I'll come back to it. Right, while well, Jace is doing some movement, as predicted, he's charged here. He's managed to get three on that one there, two on that one there, and three on that, and then those two are there. Um, has he overextended his hive? Why not? Because it's only 18 inches from that. He's run no, the carnifix forward. That. Oh, he doesn't care about this flank, that's fine. These have come stomping forward here. Do I fire the heavy bolters into him, or do I chance my hellfire shells into the carnifix? <laughs> oh dear, what do I do? Either way, if I fire these heavy bolters into them, it's going to be minus two because it's minus one for firing uh, on Overwatch from a creature emerging from cover, and it's minus one because of the speed. So it's minus two. So even Space Marines on Overwatch are going to need fives, and the heavy bolts will need fours. But I've got to do it. <clears throat> be rude not to. But it's what's he going to do with these two? Well, he's going to charge, and of course he is. Chase is all about the charge. And classic Hormogaunts falling over on terrain. We all love it. So the gargoyles, there we go, are flying high. Um, my heavy bowers probably have got the range to do that. Uh, they're from there, 36. And they're range 40. Uh, yeah, it might be in range, mate. Yeah, but I'm right on the back of the board. So the whole board is 48. No, it's fly when you fly out, but it'd be minus one. It'd be minus one. Minus two, minutes, speed. No, minus one. There's no speed involved. Oh, no? No, it's okay. really bizarre. Um, if I don't do it now, you're going to come down and torch me anyway. Uh, it's strength, you're going to get so many hits. Hang on, I'll need to pause this a minute. Right, the um, Devastator squads are too far behind. There's no way I can reach the gargoyles when they take off, so I'm going to have to suck it and see. Which is going to be a little bit a little bit annoying. Uh, right, they've got a range of 30s. There's a, there, there's is a range of 32. No, high point. High point of 12, mate. 12. So that'd be 18. So I'll move six. Yep. 18. So I can actually move these 18 as well. Yep, you'll be fine. Oh, yeah, it's. it's when I used to play, well, Jace is moving those models. When I used to play Nids back in the day, I would never have done this, fielded this many Hormogaunts, but they are so scary. In fact, I used to field a lot of Termogaunts, thinking that was the way ahead, but I don't know now. It's nasty seeing all these Hormogaunts come across. But this is why I think sometimes ruins, even though the book it says they're not classed as difficult terrain. You imagine how, you know, you get minus two to hit them, but there's no penalties on your movement. Yeah. You imagine if you have penalties on your movement, you'd be reduced to a nine inch move through there for the whole Would you say don't range of these bike pads or was? 36. 36? Yeah. You're out of range. Really? Yeah, I guarantee it. I'm not going to turn it, I might be in range of your chat room. Uh, yeah, I suppose so. I'll be hilarious. Please don't. <laughs> oh, he's having a go. It'll be minus two. 
And you've got a bullet skill of four. So you three, four, fives to hit. Fives to hit. And then you, if you miss, you need this Garen's uh, artillery dice. And don't do what I did and blow my own jaw off. Or you're running 12. <laughs> It'd be a hell of a shot if you're in range, but I don't think you are. Mm, might not be. I don't think you are. Oh, he's got a plan. Look, everybody's got a plan, and he's sticking to it. Oh, look at him trashing my models. He don't care. He don't care. And then those things can come forward and shoot, or you can run them. No, it's going to go forward to get into the building. What you gonna do? That's all on Overwatch. It certainly is. Stay on Overwatch. Right. Well, to be fair, you meant to declare charges. I'm not charging. Wait, I'm gonna do my Overwatch then. <laughs> so, no, I was charge him. I thought, nah, if you can't move, I'm leaving there. Don't matter, I can, I can, I can shift. Yeah. Right, so, uh, I'm gonna, seeing that this is your turn, but I've got to do a lot of shooting, I'm gonna pass this back to you. Yep. Right, okay. So, first of all, Devastate Unit's gonna have a little crack. I can't overwatch, uh, I can't overwatch, I can't rapid fire with bolters, but you got one, two, three bolter shots, needing, uh, are you playing? Is it playing? Uh, one, yeah. two, threes, fours, fives. Two hits, threes to kill, one dead. That's gonna be the closest one. And then two heavy bolters. Uh, well, they need fours because of the targeters. One hit. Causing four hits. Not bad. Thank you. Causing twos to kill, three more dead. Right, so that's them done. Right, so these can shoot through these. We've got a nice line of sight there, and the bolters as well. So what I will do is I will fire the bolt pistols first because of the range. So 16, 1, 2, 3. They will need. Uh, One, two, isn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah, so they're going to need fives. Nope. So the bolters. Three, oh, two bolters because he can't see. We well, might be able to. They should be able to, yeah. Yeah, right. So three bolters, needing fives. One hit, two to kill, uh, three to kill. Yeah, one dead. And then the two heavy bolters, needing fours. One hit. Now, I cannot target the ones, the, the shots cannot carry on to the ones in the. No, train. Train. Five hits, so on those four. Choose to kill. Oh, only three dead. And that's those two gone. And then this unit here. Oh. Right angle of fire takes that corner fix out. So what's it? Where's your laser mounts? Uh, no, we're done. No, we're done. Right, okay. And I can't turn. Nope. Well, you can turn and overwatch. So I could do that. But then no, no, bring him in. No, it'd be closer. So, do you know what? These four will fire at them. Can you spit fire? Uh, you're a monster, so I can target different things. Oh, okay. Um, so he can target that, like you can target a vehicle. It's not like third where you've got to fire everything at. Oh, yeah. So. They're trained to do this. So what I'm gonna do is I've actually got to target him with the last cannon, uh, which means these two will fire at that one. Oh no, I can see them, can't I? Yeah. I'll do that right. So four bolters. Actually he can't, he's in the way, so here fire at him. Hits him, doesn't kill him. Those three will fire at them. Two hits, two dead. 
And then the last cannon, oh, it's a big gun, big dice. Need fours to hit him. Yep. Yeah. Uh, need threes to wound him. Yep. Yeah. That's a four plus save for you, sir. Nope. nope. That's uh, nine and one, two d six. Oh, you bastard! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so when to get a nice shot then, even if I <laughs> even if I got through and didn't kill you. Um, oh mate, because it's minus yeah, six yeah, on the yeah, last card. Sorry guys. Uh, that's my overwatch done, mate. You can carry on with your turn now. Do you want to give me the well uh, you've done, isn't it? Oh no, you got no, six in, haven't you? Got for right. I'm gonna pass this over. Oh yeah, we've got combat. Yeah, we've got combat, so there we go. I got it, I got it. <laughs> oh that would have been so good! Right, so then let's see. So there's nothing within break tent. Well everything's passed. Alright. Uh, uh, you're not going to shoot that man? Yeah. Alright, cool. Angle the dangle. Oh, you need the dangle of the angle, don't you? Yeah, so the, he's got to shoot them because I think that's out of angle dangle. And he's in the way. He's in the way. So they'll be, he'll be shooting them. Them. Yeah. So... Right, sadly, we haven't got uh, a D12. I didn't bring a D12 with me. You sure you haven't got a D12, mate? Because I used all my D12s on the Kings of War thing for wound counters. Like a club. Jace is just looking for a D12. Okay, Jace hit with his Venom Cannon. That's going to point in the direction of him. So what we've got is him automatically and the guy with the banner on a 4+. plus. Nope. nope. So it's two to sniping me bloody character. A 6 to save. Yes! In your face, Venom Cannon! Now that was scary. So what I'm going to do is play Sabotage on you. Because I checked the codex, I can play that. It means you can only fire that gun now on a four, five, or six. <sighs> I was going to play it on them, which will probably be the worst mistake, and I should have, but I didn't like that. <laughs> That's alright. So that doesn't splatter, does it? Like the other one you've no, seen? No, no, no. Right, so these. And well, the only ones I can see are. Yeah, there. and they're technically in cover, so you can ignore them for them. Yeah. But you can only shoot what's in the open, so it'd be. Could be laser. Uh, your laser. Yeah. I've got your laser here, so I think you're fine. I've got it, mate. No, so you can only kill those two. two. Right, so it's worth it. Yeah. Range of 32, sir. I'm assuming you're in range. Should be. I would have thought so. That's 24 gun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, plenty, plenty. Right, so uh, you got a ballista skill of four, so threes to hit. Two hits. Uh, two's to wound. Two, wounds. two saves on a five or a six. Blessed be the marine. So that's one model killed there. So which one are you on about that splatter thing? That one, which I'm going to come to. Oh, okay. Give us a chance. Right. So he survives, so that splash. He's got to be within two inches, so you hit him on a four, five, or six, which you do. It's strength three, so it's strength... Ah, uh, it gets a wound, and it's a basic save, which I do. Oh, that's a nice loaded dice. Keep that bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> right, combat, here we go. Oh, that's not a break test win yet, is it? Not yet, no. Uh, we'll do this one, and then we'll do this off camera. So... You're, you've lost the charge bonus through your weapon skills uh, oh. one. So I'm frenzied, so I get three attacks. I can't parry. Weapon skill of four. I've got ten. All right. A weapon skill of five, so I've got eleven. I've got ten. Yeah, because that would have been a draw if you hadn't charged. But, well, you know, during. If I charged. Uh, so strength four, threes to kill. Yeah, one dead. All right, let's take one away. Okay, so now you get an extra dice, and now you're plus one, so we're the same. So I've got, oh, I've got a five and a one for you. I've got five, Plus one it on me nine, then. ten. One it on me. One it. What is strength four? Strength four, force to win. Minus one, four plus save. Saved it. Right, okay, now you're plus two, so you're plus one on the weapon skill against me. Plus and two it, Oh no, yeah, yeah, sorry. Plus one. So I've only got uh, eight in total. Uh, nine, and you've got ten, eleven. So it's two hits. Ten. 11. That's right. Oh, is it just one hit? Two hits, is it? Yeah, well, I, yeah so two hits, leading fours. One. Got one. Saved it. So I held. So we'll just do the rest off camera. Okay, after a bloody combat, he held it. 
He took a wound and he took My dice rolls were terrible. So I um, should have kept filming that. But there you go. So two brothers will die at the end of this battle. And that's the end of turn one because there's no psychics in this game at all. Um, it's not looking good. That was such an unfortunate shot. But then oh, he's lucky to be there now. That's it. So I get a squad turn up. I potentially got my bike to turn up. And let's take the battle to the nids. It's Captain Danny leading it, and Danny likes to charge. Okay, turn two coming up. Okay, here we go, turn two. So this squad's run on. I'll get a run counter on them in a minute. Uh, Chaplain and Atavor charged into there. I know they're dead meat. Bike squads come over there. Because they're a squadron, I can spread them out four inches, which I have. So if one does act strange, it's only going to affect one. Uh, and they're going to take some shots at this unit of formal gaunts here. Uh, these guys here, I don't know. I'm thinking of targeting on the home guns. So I'll have to deal with the carnifixes in a minute and the hive tower. These are going to try and mop up the survivors there because they can rapid fire. But the last cannon is going to have a crack at that one. Uh, these I don't know what to do with, so they've gone into watch. And the heavy boaters are going to hopefully try and clear up this one, or the boaters will. And then the heavy boaters are going to have a crack at the warriors. warriors. Yeah. That's the plan anyway. And then the gargoyles are going to come down and torch everything anyway. So when do we do Jonesy? Uh, Jonesy will start at the beginning of your... Well, I suppose now. Maybe. Yeah. It's all right. No, oh, I'm all right. What is it? Was six. Jonesy. Oh, it's a six. Six. Generally, it's only a six, but, you know, that's not to be sniffed at. So what we will do is do their three shots at them. Those two in the open. Yep. Uh, they, well, they come with the target. Now let's get the ones in the open first. My, I've got moved over 10, so... Yes, yeah, so it's minus one, so I need threes to hit. Minus one, fours. Threes. Target is three. So only one hit, but it's twin linked, so it's twos to ruin that one model, and I do. So one's dead. Right. This lot. I'm going to have a crack at them in the cover. So, rapid fire with the boaters. In range. So that's six shots. Hang on, you'd like... It's, no, it's not. It's your way round. You can ignore people in cover who are closer to shoot people out in the open further away. You can't ignore people who are closer in the open who are in the cover. So who's closer? You have to measure it whoever is closest to over these two units. Right, so that's 24 to him, and that's 24 to him. So it doesn't really matter. That's right. Yeah, that's, but that's the well, way I'll tell you what, dude, to make your life happy, well, no, it's, that's... I'll do these first. Because they're facing that way in. Anyway. Yeah, you turned those, yeah. So they will have a crack at them then. So it's one, two, three, four. Minus one to hit. This is your movement. So this is eight rapid fire shots, and the last cannon's having to go in. Yeah. So eight rapid fire needing fours to hit. One, two, three, four. And threes to kill. One left. Okay, and one last cannon out of that corner fix. Hits, doesn't wound. You're not going to do nothing now, are you? Right, okay. So now I can have a pop at them. Yep. Do I fire? It's only minus two. No. I'll have to deal with them in a minute. Right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Six? Oh, yeah. Three yeah. bolt fires, rapid firing. Well, one, one, minus two, is it? Uh, minus three. Minus three, oh, okay. So six is to hit. What it? Yeah, because it's minus one for your speed and minus two for the yeah. cover. One wound, one dead. Oh, you're um, just tough as three, aren't they? Yeah. And then two heavy boaters needing fives. One it. Causing a jam. One and a jam. Don't need that. No, he would die first. Only one. Don't need that. Don't need that, and then just the rubbin so in. No, he does wear one and kills it. Oh, that's a okay, that's living unit. Yeah. Right, so that's that. Right, these guys then. Uh, three every boat shots. Two every boat, what you mean? Uh, three boat <laughs> shots, I mean. Three boat shots. I've got to target and cover, so it's going to be sixes to hit. Oh yeah, yeah, because I've moved. Because here go, but then I can go into the cover. Yeah. Two hits. That's not bad, mate. It's all right, it's not bad. One, One dead. Oh, let's take him away then. Might as well, yeah. And then, 
It's fours to hit them. Who? These? Yeah. Because it's threes minus two, fours, targets. Yeah. Uh, fives. Fours to hit them. No hits. Pricks. Right, combat. We'll do this guy up here, and then we'll, we'll um, do it off camera. So, you haven't got your charge bonus now. So your weapon skill's four. Oh, that's not bad. That gives me 11. I got 10. So that's one hit. Kills him. What's your minus one? What's it say? You don't have one. Oh, okay. Right, so, next one. We're equal. Down to the dice. I got 11, 12. Uh, you, Chris, uh, I've got eight. Eight. Uh, no, you got a weapon skill of five, so you got nine. Oh, nine. I got 11, 12, nine, three hits. Killed him. And I've got to console it in. So I've got to jump down into them, even though they're probably dead in a minute. These guys, I'll do the one that charged in first. Okay. To try and save his comrades. Uh, so he's got a weapon of six. Oh, look at that. That's 12. I've got nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, because I've got an extra. Guys, oh, two sixes, wasn't it? Yeah, uh, yeah. Oh, this is with the power fist, so two's to wound. Yeah, right, he's, he's dead. dead. And then the next one. Now you get plus one extra attack. Oh, I've got six, 12, 13. I've got uh, nine, Ooh. nine. You're dead, because that's a power fist. Yeah. So he's got the move towards the enemy. He doesn't get to do anything because he didn't get the fight. No. Uh, Chaplin's gone absolutely, absolutely bedlam. Two attacks. Uh, no extra weapon, but can parry. Two attacks. Weapon skill of five, charging. Oh, hang on. Uh, you've got your weapon skill. It's a hero, mate. You might be six. I'm holding that for a hero. Chaplin, weapon skill of six, and this sticks. Two attacks, not extra weapon, but he's got a storm shield. So he has got five, 11, 12. I've got. Parry that, because of my shield. There we go. I'm just going to roll a couple of these. Yeah. He's dead because of strength five. He's only fighting two of them, so you get to. Oh, the other one's fighting that. Oh, no, he's not. He's, no, he's, not, he's, already, he's not engaged yet. Yeah. Uh, so you get plus one. I've got five, uh, 11, 12, 13. Keep I've got four. nine. 10, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, he's dead. So that's that one gone. Yeah, that's him. This one? Yeah, and then he's fighting that one as well. How many is he fighting? Two or three? Uh, oh no, because he was against him, wasn't yeah. he? Yeah, so he's fighting, he was fighting two. That's right, because these two should be yeah. punched in there. Right, so him with one wound left is fighting. So you've lost the charge bonus, so I've got weapons to the five. Oh, uh, mine's for you. nine plus that one will be ten. Ten, and I've got eight, so two hits. Fours to wound. Two Ooh, wounds. Three plus save. No, dead, he's dead, dead, proper dead. So he's dead, and then he charged into that one there. We should have. Did you pause this? No. Oh, okay. Oh, I've got one for you. Oh, that cancels that out. I've got basically six. I've got ten. Yeah, he's dead. Now, are you in hive mind? I wouldn't have thought so. Better check that. 18, isn't it? Oh, just in. Um, yep, yeah, you're just in, bugger. Right, so that means these have to turn around. And you have to compile them, because you're not going to go anywhere else. Right, well, they've already moved, he can't move, so that's it. So that's where we're at. So we have to turn around and take them on, and that's gone. That's it, that's my turn done, mate. All right. Okay, well, Jason's doing the majority of his movement. Uh, this lictor is charged into there. He can only get one, so that man's dead. Uh, I can overwatch. What I didn't specify, and uh, quite rightly, Jason's not let me do it, I, when I put him in overwatch, I just assumed all that lot which would have been command to Danny as well, and he's got a melter gun. Um, but alas, no, and quite rightly, too. Over here, it's turned up really bad. Uh, another squad has charged into these, so they're now fighting quite a lot, and I don't think I'm going to come out of that. 
These two have turned around to start blipping away on the bikes and we know what's coming. We know they're coming down. I'm not in overwatch. This is going to hurt. But if it doesn't hurt, <coughs> then they're dead meat. Here they come, flaming. Don't forget, I'll have to move out the way. So I'll go that way, that way, that way, that way. Don't forget, you can't flame through your own models. And you can't push me off the board. Right, here's the first squad coming down. So there, we knew what was going to happen. So those Devastators are probably dead. Uh, I am going to overwatch those three Assault Marines into them to lessen, hopefully, the effects of their Flamers. The Lich has sprung from cover. Jace did say at the beginning of the battle he was on the edge there, so he was hanging off that pillar. I did measure from there, but no, he's well in with there. Just out of range of the heavy weapon, but it doesn't matter because they're consolidated into him anyway. And then this lot is going to have to charge in. Captain Danny might charge in as well. He's not really armed for combat, but you never, you never know. And then the other Devastator squad is going to get torched along here. And then just to rope it in, or rub it in, these here are going to charge. I'll just show you now. Da, 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 da. 18 inches. Oh, plenty, mate. In fact, the only one you can't reach is that one there. All right, so I'll part, turn her away. Because you can't reach him. Okay. Yep. It's all gone kind of wrong. It says I'm joking on a biscuit to comfort my nerves. Right, so, oh, watch. Three pistols at them. One hit. No. Oh. Three hits. You freeze a hit normally. Yeah. Yeah. Minus one goes to fours. Yeah. Bolt pistol close range. Oh, plus two. Oh, brilliant. Three to kill. Three dead. See how nice I am there, see? Oh, you can. Oh, well, it's going to be the closest, so it's going to be all three. Yeah, see how nice I was to you then? That's right, minus one for Overwatch, yeah, because you get nothing in the White Dwarf. It was QA. And, and bolt pistols on plus two dead close range. Yeah. Close range, they? So it's yeah. QA in um, a White Dwarf that swooping orcs and um, gargles landing down don't suffer the fast movement. Yeah. And he even quotes um, the longest day, the black and white film. Yeah. Right, so that's, mm, I doubt it saved them. Oh, but that's the old... being nice to you. And one bolt pistol at him. Uh, it's you. Plus two at short range. Uh, the, the... Oh no, because oh, no, it's the speed um, and emerging from cover. So I actually needed a three there. Do you literally get any? Oh, they don't necessarily want No, them. unless they stay still. Yeah. Right, so, shooting. Right, uh, <laughs> got a laser light there, mate. Laser light? Yeah. Oh my god, you're kidding. I'm not. Right, so, you can fire at those four. Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh my god. Hey. Freeze to it. You just shot through their fellows. I yeah, yeah, yeah. They, 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 well. I just get some shots here. They, oh, yeah, I should have <laughs> left them, yeah. <laughs> well done, yeah. <laughs> Bugger. Kind of yeah, bloody work. Work the job. Um, Freeze to it. Three hits. All hit, right. Two's to wound. All wounded. Five to save. One dead. But splatter. So basically, roll four dice. Right, and, f and again, because you hit twice at least. That's no. two. Two hits. Oh, it's, two it's two hits on a four plus. Alright. The, the, the. Oh no, it's six, isn't it? You said six a minute ago. Where was it getting six from then? I thought it's four plus. Hang on. Right, so what'd you get? Two? Yeah. So on a four, five, or six. Oh no, that was it. So there's strength three, you need a five to wound. Right. So that's fine. Right, so he's dead. Jammy little. So if I hadn't a shot them, well, oh, you're monstrous creatures anyway. You'd be able to probably see them. Oh, okay. But I want to force it because you're height two, and I'm height two kind of thing, wouldn't it? Yeah. So that's gonna be a lot. So basically, if you do him first, yeah. you'll push me out of the template and, and him. push into the back. So I'll have to. So basically, you got. Th well, because it's so close, he's not fully covered. So those, those two, one on a four, five, or six. No. Nope. Yeah. Right. Five to wound. 
One, one, minus two. Uh, so he's dead, so the closest one. Right, we're gonna do this off camera because these two will now move. So now I've moved him out of the template to the nearest edge. He's in now in a position to hit all three. So you need fives to win. One. Another one. But I'll save that one. And again, I need to move him. Into so, because we've moved across like that, this one here is flamed and actually caught the flamer. Uh, so you need a five, yeah. five to win. No. Yeah. Right, there we go. So I lost two, so that's a break test. Which I passed because my commander's there, Captain Danny's there. Luckily. Yeah. Uh, right, so that's fine. So what's going to happen there is here go in with him. That's going to disappear. Right. Oh, haha! <laughs> Right, so... Should we do over here first? Right, four, five, or six, you fire your heavy venom cannon. No, so that paid off. So the bioplasma, I didn't move very fast, so you're going to need fours to hit. That's yep. a hit, that's going to be a blast. Roll for location. One. That's going to be the... Oh, it's over there by the biscuits, mate. That's probably the rider. Rider. And then a four, five, six, you hit the bike. No. So the rider's two to wound. Of course, I think it's minus three to save, is it? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know. Well, why not? Hang on. No, I'll bring the camera around. Doo -doo -doo. It's got to be minus four. Surely. Oh, I missed it, man. Yeah, minus four, so he's dead. So that bike's going to go out of control. So that'll be the nearest one. So the guy with a power sword. So yeah. just spin him around for a minute. We know he's out of control then. They're immune to psychology because they're a squadron. <sighs> Luckily. Right, uh, and that's your shooting. No, 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 we're done. We're moving on now. No. Yeah, uh, okay. Right, so who do you want to go first? Um, so he can yeah. get... Right. Uh, this is quite badly placed. So... Two and a four plus. One, and then that one definitely. So two and a five. Doesn't wound, but they've got to be moved. So I'm going to pause this. Right, so Jace is filming this at the moment because I'm busy doing template maneuvers. Yep. So they went that way and then they were forced back in. Uh, this one has flamed these two and got two sixes. So I need a five or a six to save them. No, they're both dead. Ouch, which means this one can hit those two on a four plus. Because you've got to try and get yep, the most. Nothing. This one, oh, that's quite cool. Yeah, do that. I'm doing, I'm doing it as if it's yeah. me now. I'm forgetting the fact I'm space range. Uh, one on a four plus. Right, so it's those two. Have we just got another one? one? Saved it, and then uh, that's so that was that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. This one hasn't played, has it? No. Nope. Uh, so that's going to be two on a four plus. Uh, two on a whammy. One yeah, wound. One wound. Saved it. it. But it's a break test. Oh! oh they're shaken. Yeah. Oh Jesus Christ! But well, that's a point for you because you got yeah. two eyes. But you still shoot though, mate. Well, no, because it's jammed, isn't it? Yeah, but the other one isn't. Oh yeah, that's true. Right. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right, okay. So they're shaken. Thank God for Marines. Uh, right then, sir. Do you want me to take over from the dice? Uh, camera again? Yeah, please. It's technically your turn. Right. Got it. I got away with that. To be perfectly honest with you. Yeah. But I'm not going to get away with the combat. Right. We'll do me the lictor lictor. Right, go on then. Let me look at how many attacks do they have? <sighs> you got four attacks. I got two. I can parry, you can't. You got a weapon skill of seven, charge and eight, so you've got 14. I'll tell you when we do that six then. Oh yeah, go on and parry it. Yeah, well there we go. So you got eight, nine, ten, eleven. I've got four, ten, eleven. You win, you got RNS. Two's to kill. Two's to wound. Cock dice. Six to save. No, he's dead. As expected. Right, we'll just go into and the then I've, I know you've got enough space to get into him. Yep. 
Right, so here we go. Who's going to go first? Uh, There's no going down the initial, you get to choose. Right, we might as well do start this way and go that way, mate. Right, one attack. Oh, uh, it's down to dice. Six. Ooh. Six. Six. Stand off. Extra man. Nine. Then you got one it. You got ten, eleven. Ten, eleven. You're, 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 what we've decided as a house rule. One. One Ooh, dead. What we've decided as a house rule is if you're charging into cover, because cover really doesn't play a lot in the second edition, you lose your charge bonus. Right. Next turn. Right. Oh, yeah. Uh, five. Nice. Oh, yeah, go on. Roll a couple. Oh, no, better do it properly because it might save it. Uh, I've got nine. I've got what's I might want to start with? 18. Oh, you lose your charge bonus, don't you? Uh, so I've got nine, ten. You've got uh, seven, thirteen. Three hits needing twos. Go on. Two sixes needed. No, he's dead. Right, so actually, I've got to stop you there because that's a break test. We're okay. Because the commander's there. It's a 12 inch yeah, bubble, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. so the victor will go into your missile launcher. Not yet. Oh, yeah, you can do. Last cannon, so he's there, but he won't be there. So I'm minus one to my, leadish, my weapon skill because I have every weapon. Why you got two dots, bro? Because I'm being greedy. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! All right, go on then. Oh no, that's not too bad. Uh, so you've five, got four, five, six, seven, and I've got three. So it's four hits. Force to wound, sir. Force to wound. Three. Three. No, he's dead. Of course, he's dead. Well, I'll move him in a minute because I need right. two hands on that. And then I've already taken a break test. This bad boy here. Oh, nice. Oh, I beat you by one. And I'll kill you. Yeah. Don't come at me without your banner. Right, so uh, they're tied in. Yep. So he can move. I'm sorry, brother. <laughs> The way in. <laughs> uh, that's that. Oh, they, they can move. They won't get into him because they can't reach him. But you can move closer, like so. Oh, go on. Oh, balance. Balance. There we go. Uh, welcome back after this commercial break. <laughs> Come in there. Right, last part of the fight here. This one here, he was on his own. Uh, last one of the squad's got six hits. How many wounds? Only one. Oh. And I saved it. So hopefully I can mop that up. So he is going to go in. No, I won't. I'll charge him instead. Might as well make a count. Uh, you hatred, mate. You've got to. No. Oh, yeah. So I'll, that's fine. Oh, I wasn't re rolling this. This once. That's a different unit, so it'll be a new combat. Oh, it's not looking good. Right, turn three coming up. Okay, turn three, or as I like to call it, holy crap. Right, so the bikes are gonna stand, stay still, and rapid fire into the hive tyrant. We've got combat going on here. He's had to go into there, so I'm hoping to take them out, but then next turn, old muncher there's gonna take them out. These have moved to rapid fire. Um, and he's moved forward to do a metal gun. He's going to fire his bolt pistol. Ah. No, I want to clear the jam. I'll clear the jam. Here, fire, and here, rapid fire. I'm afraid you're dead meat, brother, and you must die at our hands, not the enemy's. So I've moved the flamer forward to flame all that. Bolt pistol into there, rapid fire into there as well. Uh, Captain Danny. Wants to save his brother Marine, he's going to fire both his bolt gun and his metal gun into that. <laughs> Such a great rule. And then this lot are hopefully going to leather this lot out. So I'm going to pass this over to Jace now. And let's do some dirty underhand. Shoot them. Shoot them both. Right, well, okay. I you. hope it, what happened to me happens to you now. <laughs> yeah, that was great, isn't it? So where are you going to start? I don't know. Right, I'll tell you what. We're going to rapid fire it into him. Um... Well, it's just in range. Right, okay. Bloody hell. Four shots. Uh, need him minus two. So, target is fours. Two hits. Need in sixes, though. No, didn't think so. 
Right. Okay. Oh, and the bike went out of control there, didn't it, Jay? Yeah, it went bang. Right, so these three rapid firing, uh, four actually, because I turned on the spot. Rapid firing at them. I can't shoot past there, so he can draw a line of sight down to that one. So that's as far as I can go. Yep. So through, past, through so, the cover. Yes, yeah, so it'll be minus two. two. Might as well. Yeah. Cover across that. So minus two, plus one at short range, minus. Did, plus, did bolts get plus one? Minus plus, plus one. Plus. Oh, I can rapid fire a bolt pistols, can't I? Uh, yeah. But it's eight inches. So. Out. There's no half range, mate. No, bolt pistols are zero to eight is plus two, eight to sixteen is yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what I was looking at. All oh, right. So basically, what I've got to do is four shots at plus two, minus two, two so three. it's threes to it. With the other four, we need fours because of the yeah bolts. Right. So they all hit, and then these need fours. Two. So, so six, six hits six. against five models. Three's to kill. One, two, three. Then I've got a metal gun, uh, which hits, because there's plus one at short range. So it's on uh, minus one to the cover. Minus two. Oh, no, I need four. Yeah, four, yeah. Crap, in you. So let's slow three dead. Uh, that's a break test, because you're out of high point. What's the least ship? Six. Was it ten? I don't know, that's what I'm asking you. It's your army. I don't know, I looked at one, I looked at one army and I was like, oh, we're going to need ship 10. Five, they're gone. So they do fall up, fall back or? Uh, fall back, I suppose. How was it? Three, how many dice? Uh, 3d6, I would have thought, wasn't it? Is it fast as 3d6 or is that the range? Do you want to pause that a sec? Right. Right, so they're out of hive mind, they're broken, they don't take off. The standard rules say we thought maybe they'd fall back faster, but that's a bit later additions, and that's the problem with playing too many additions. Uh, they fell back 2d6, they didn't go that far, they're not moving fast now. So I'm with N8, and all these oh, will be hitting on twos. Do you know what? I want to get rid of them. So I'm going to actually not fix this jam. I'm going to rapid fire with this bolt pistol. Two's to hit. So you missed anyway. No, the two, there's a two there, mate. Oh, it's two straight, isn't it? And it's three's to kill. Yeah, they're dead. They're dead. I, need, I needed to. You need the points. Well, it's not so much that. I don't want to rally and then coming back and flaming my tripsy. Right, so that is still jammed. But at the end of this turn, I can try and rally them as well. I'll do that in a minute because that's uh, nasty. Right, these then, again, I'm not going to bother with the heavy bombers. I'm going to rapid fire with my bolt pistols because it's just a better shot. So it's going to be uh, six shots, needing twos, needing threes. Yep, One, two, three. Yep. That's it. That's them gone. It does mean it frees up the heavy bombers if I survive the next round of death spit of shooting. Danny, don't let me down, mate. So, right. Which one's which? Red one's going to be two. Red one's a metal gun. Got the targeter and all that yeah. crap. So there's twos to hit. Both hit. On a one or a two, it hits I hit the marine. Oh, crap. Oh, yes, you hit the marine with the melter. <laughs> twos, to kill, twos to kill him. No! Wounds you, though. Five plus. Wounded you? Put a wound on your bad boy. Oh, oh whoopee. Yeah. How many wounds you got? Lots. I think he's got three left, actually. I should know this. Oh, he's only a warrior profile. Oh, no, he's not a warrior. You were lucky you didn't kill your own man then. Two wounds left, yeah. Yeah, I was. Oh, Danny. Right. So, what we're going to do is we're going to flame this lot. Right, so. That's going to be basically those three and my man. Or Matley. And the Lictor on a full plus. Oh, it's all full plus, is it? No, but you're not fully covered. Oh, yeah, but are you fully covered? Who's fully, no one's fully covered? Yeah. All oh, right. Yeah, don't worry about it. All right, sorry. This one on a full plus. 
No, so he actually doesn't get torched. Oh, right. These three are fully covered. Yeah. Yeah. So I can't escape that. No. It's just, just the way it is. So me, I don't wound. See if you catch on fire. I will, don't worry. Yeah. And then the other three are dead. Um, do I catch on fire? Uh, is that right or is it six? Nice. Why do I do this? It's, I, think it's, I think you are, mate. I think I am. Yeah. It's worth it. <laughs> it's worth it. <laughs> Flamer, it's going to be the rules, whatever. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I'm on fire. As if I've got, I've got enough to contend with. Right, so he's got to take a break test. Which you fail, so you run back 2d6. Three. Three. And you're broken. Right, that's the flame. So he's gonna. You know what you're on fire now, mate. I'm gonna put you out of your misery. He's gonna fire a quote pistol. Hits, one, two, it's you. Yeah. Didn't didn't wound your brother. Okay, so now he's gonna shoot into combat, he's gonna shoot him. So rapid fire with a pistol. Both hit. Killed him. And then rapid fire, sorry brother. Both hit. Yeah. Ooh, one each. I'll do my brother first. Do you? No. Oh, right. That one too bad. It's not good. <laughs> because you'll kill him in my turn, which leaves you free to charge what you like. Yeah. Right, speaking of which, combat. Where do you want to start? That end or that end? Let's <laughs> do here. Right, so I've got four attacks, haven't I? Yeah, I've got two. I'll have that one and power that five. Perfect. So what's right. my weapon skill? Your weapon skill is seven, so you got ten. Ten. I got nine, ten, one it on me. Because uh, I've got one. Wounds. Saved it! I saved it! Oh my god! Right, this bad boy, one attack. Oh, I have a weapon skill. Are you nine. on fire and you've got a heavy weapon? Oh, I can't fight. I don't think I can fight then. Oh, in fact, I think the rules state you won't fight me because I'm on fire. I can really? Ignore. Yeah, you don't, you don't fight. You ignore me. So you get the charge next turn. Oh, okay. Uh, well, I'll double check that, but I think, yeah, you can't fight people who are on fire. Why not? Because it says on the rules. Pause it, I'll check. Yeah, because we were actually in combat, weren't we? Yeah. Right, so we right, so we just killed him. We we killed him. He, he got acted up by that one. Yep. Um, but I'm sure I saw somewhere in an FAQ or something. You ignore burning models in combat. You can't attack them because you don't want to cover covered in flaming fluid anyway. Anyone care, would no. Right, so here we go. So it's my turn. So I'm going to go first. So the chaplain is going to have a crack at him. I didn't charge him because quite rightly Jason said I can't because I've got to move within two inches. Uh, I've, I've got, got eight. 10, 11. 8, 9, 10, 11. Two to kill. Yeah, he's dead. dead. So that's another squad gone. So that's one, three squads. Two, three squads gone. Okay. This guy. This guy? This guy. Because this is all one squad yeah. now, isn't it? Oh no. Oh no. I've got uh, 10. you got. 10, 11, I've got 10, so won it. No, no worries. Uh, this guy, he's, been, he's dead me anyway, so. Oh no, definitely with that roll. Oh no. I've got eight. Same here, same in ish. And this guy, fighting two. Oh, we should have killed one of them. I've got 10, uh, I've got 11. Eight, nine, 10, 11. Three hits, mate. Forced to wound. One. One. Saved it. You'd be saving them left, right, and centre, yeah? I obviously haven't. 
Oh, come on. Now. This is the second. The second. This dice. is the second yeah. guy, so you oh. should be rolling an extra dice. Yeah, three dice, isn't it? Right. So you've got eight, eight. Nine. nine. I've got eight. One it. No, takes a wound. Mm, it's not bad because that's one, two, two. Yeah. They don't want one and do hold up for. So I've only got one more turn to survive, which I'm not going to do. Uh, right, so here oh, we yeah, get him. Yeah. Come on, guys. So I've got nine. I've got eight. One it. Oh, does, you're right, I might be safe. Oh, oh, model. Man down, man down. Um, I might be saving, but I'm not wounding. No. Uh, oh, and he's got the go crazy. Um, you got the in, yeah. Okay, he's a check. Right, okay, that's the end of my turn. Your right. turn three coming up. Right, well, Jace is doing his bits and pieces. We forgot to roll for morale for these guys. I actually failed. Leech of eight, I rolled a nine, so they are broken, so they're out for the game. I've got to try and rally them at the end of the turn, uh, or else Jace gets victory points for them. Right, so it's shooting time. Hang on, I've got to tell everybody what you did, everybody. He is a quarter of an inch out of charge range for that, but because he turned up there, them and them. Oh, and Commander. He's all right. They all, yeah, what a laugh. They would have all, they've all had to take a terror test. Not them, because they've had to suffer it already. Uh, so that's fine. As we well know, they're broken, so I've got to try and rally them. Uh, Jonesies. Uh, that's done on my turn. Was it? Well, yeah. It will be technically your turn, but I rolled it last turn. So uh, they're going to stay there because they can draw clear line of sight to them. He's in combat there, he's in combat there, he should kill those two, and it's just a bloody mess over here, but the th sad thing is, the chaplain hates, so he's going to move towards the enemy, and because they're frenzied, and I, oh no, he can restrain them, because he's there. Uh, but he's got hatred himself. Doesn't matter, that's only in the first round of combat, he's not a frenzy, so I might be able to pull him back, control him. If they weren't under the control of the chaplain, they have to charge. They're controlled. You want just hatred do? I think hatred you got charged. Hate, no, it? I don't. It just means I get to re-roll. Is it? Oh, I'll, right. I'll check in a minute. Maybe it does. So don't scream at the TV, everybody. We'll check in a minute. Right, so shooting, sir. Right, we'll do these three first. Yeah. Needing fours. fours. Threes, sorry. Threes. Nice, that's all it. Two, uh, two to wound. That's it. That's three saves. Oh, I killed them all. Three ones. Jesus. Ouch! Didn't need that. That was about time. That I didn't need. That was disgusting. Right. Can't kind of fix. Yep. Spit. Needing threes. It's yep. Roll d6. That's the man and the bike on a four plus. Yep. yep. All right, the man is a two. He's dead. Right, that's fine. That'll go out of control. Turn him round. Right. First points for that. On a four plus. Yep. 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 Two's to hit. No. Oh, yeah, you'll want that then. Go on, please, 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 please. Oh, it's off the board. So now, what I should have done, after seeing what he did there with the desperate, is I should have, I should have sabotaged them. You should have. Oh, well, never mind. Right, so that's that. What we'll do is a quick combat here, because it's going to be ugly. So that's uh, eight, nine for me, and you've got 13. So it's three, four, it's dead. Right, that's a third of the unit. Got to take a break test. 10, they're all right, because he's leadership of 10. Right. Can you solid that me into your flamer? Because it should have been, would have been two inches of problem. Right? No, because I spaced him out quite well. And don't forget, he's moved. So he's at... Oh, okay. I can ignore him because he was in combat, so two inches will put you about there. That's right. Get closer. That's right. So here we go. One attack. Oh god, just roll some wounds, mate. We'll class that as your wounds. There, one dead. Break test for them. They're okay. Extra man. Oh Jesus. Just rolled a couple of wounds. There we go. Dead. Jesus, look at him. I'm savage with my wounds. Right, so you got a two inch consolidation as well. Well, you can stay, stay there. Stay there, they're quite coming out. 
Or you can move towards them. Or they can't. No, no, no. You have two inches, but keep them in the thing. Yeah. Happy with? Yeah. Right, we'll come back after this motley crew. Okay, after all that, that's there. Which is actually good because I don't have to look at the rules about having to consolidate towards the corner fix, which means I've got to charge into them, which will take me out of corner fix charge range for turn four. It's not looking good. That was a ball ache. And so was that. So the only thing I've got left to do is I can metal gun that. These are going to come forward and metal gun and rapid fire that one. But I think he gets bonuses because he's in cover. <laughs> he's going to bugger off. Oh, it's not looking good. I think you're going to kill my commander. <laughs> Don't forget you get points for those that lead. Oh, lead. crap. Lead. Oh, lead. Yeah. So I've been lucky. I've only failed my morale once. Oh, no. Yeah, twice. So they got shaken. Then they got broken. Twice. So that's two. They yeah. ran. Right. Oh, no, you killed them off. No, you killed them. Oh, yeah. So there's two there. God, yeah. And if you kill him there, that's another... Well, whatever he's worth and fixed mm. points for those that lead. Right, my turn four coming up. Okay, my last turn. Holy crap. Right, so I've charged into combat there. That bike's gone out of control. We'll go off the edge in a minute. And he's going to rapid fire into the high turn, try and get a wound on him, score me a victory point. These have come forward. They get plus one for the bolt of fire, um, but it's minus two to hit that. Normally, licked as if they don't move on minus one, but of course, he moved. Uh, these stupid idiots here. I did bring Captain Danny over to try and get within 12. I It was borderline, so. I moved him out. It's no point arguing over it. If they can't rally, that's their tough. Flamer's gonna have a crack at him. He's gonna have a crack at him, and he's gonna have a crack at him to lend support on there. Losing me heavy bolters like that, or I mean, they, technically they shouldn't have been there. You were very unlucky with your flamers. So I'm gonna pass this over to Jace now. Right. I'll save up to the last. <laughs> okay. Right, so what are you doing first? Here we go. So, first of all, cheeky two shots at the high tire. Uh, oh, both hit. Uh, yeah, because it's minus two. Oh, you got the four hits, yeah. four hits, yeah. Uh, but I need sixes to win. No, no. Right. Okay, worth a shot. Right, so, we've got a, a four, no, he's out, isn't it? Yeah. So, three shots. Uh, it'd be minus two, plus one, one. so it's minus one, so I need fours, fours. to hit. Two hits. Toughness five, fives to wound. No Nothing. wounds. Long range. No. Missed. Melt gun needs four. No, it doesn't. No. Five. Five, yeah. Nope. Bugger. So we can charge and kill them. <laughs> right. Uh, bolt pistol. Hits. Wounds. Five plus safe. This is on the. Lictor. Nope. Typical. Right. Uh, so I haven't done him yet. So nope. I'll flame him. All right. All about me. No. Does not wound him? Catch on fire? No. Oh God. Danny, you better bring it to it. So both weapons again. So it's minus. It's basically hit on twos. Yeah, because of the pluses and minuses. Oh, the the metal gun is that in range of give? Yeah, plus? six inches. Six inches. Plus okay. you got targeter. Plus you got bullets. You got seven. Yeah. Hits with both. Wait. Wounds with the metal gun. Yeah. So it's um, five or six. Are you dickhead? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, mate. <laughs> Stop having a patty on. Oh. Now you know what it's like against nids. Come on, Danny. Right. So, combat. Why don't you do the chaplain first? <laughs> yeah, did you come up? Yeah, he's just one couple dice. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, he's one's dead. Oh, hang on. Yeah, he's dead. And no, he's dead one. anyway, mate, because you're about to attack you. And really the next one? I've oh, only got two attacks. That's 11, 12. This is oh, no, I charged over combat, didn't I? So yeah. 11. Are you going, this is him going against the second guy, is it? Yeah. Oh, he's a chaplain still. Yeah. Yeah, trying to save his squad. Right. Uh, I can. No, I'll keep that. You can keep the four. So, so I've got I've 10. Got 11, I mean, eight. 11, 12. You've got yeah. eight. Eight. Dead. Right. 
That's it. Uh, yep. Oh, rallied. Holy crap. Yes. They're completely rallied. Just in time to turn around and see a liquid charge of bony ass. So, honestly, mate, you're better off charging the Devastators. There's less to kill. Or these two, he charged into them two, and them two, quite rightly, as Lictors would do, go for the command. Oh, mate, that'd be awesome. He can take them two out, piece of cake. He's got sort a of charge of seven. How many attacks has he got? Four. Yeah, he's he got weapons in a six, and I can't hurt him. Well, get a power fist in his face. But can he take the commander out? Or is what, it him? Yeah. Uh, well, you. No. No, you can't. No, okay. No, because you've got weapon skill of six, charging seven. I've got weapon skill of seven. I've got a conversion field, and if you bing off, poof, and blind them, kill them, and then charge them. Okay, yeah. Oh, right. mate, you've got to do it. Two lictors. Right. Oh, that'd be awesome. Right. We're going to pause this. No. All right, I'll pass it around then. No, just, just do I've got to do, do the rest of my stuff. Oh, all right, pause it then. I'm too excited. Okay. He charged in here, so he's going to attack him first because it's minus one because I've got a heavy weapon. Once he dies, that's the third of the unit, so I've got to take a break test. Well, actually, I'm better off attacking the other guy first. What other guy? Because I've gone against two. Well, yeah, yeah. He might have, it doesn't matter. Gonna he's going to take a break test anyway. Yeah. Uh, he can't have reached the charge against both of them because he had it, and the lictor's gone against him. He's moved these across, hopefully getting a shot at them against 32 inches. While Pazmer against the bike, if he misses, he's angled the hive tyrant to have a pop at them or we'll finish the bike off. Yeah. Right, sir. First of all, do you want to see if you're in range? What's that? 36. 32. 32, is it? Oh! Oh, look at that. And after the shooting they done last time, this is not going to be good. It'll be minus two, though, so, you know. Got a chance. Right, here we go. Are we pressing play? Yes, we're in, in the game. Uh, freeze, isn't it? Freeze for it. That'll do. Yes. Roll to the location. That's on the bike, right. and a four plus on the rider. Yeah, two's on the rider, mate. Do the rider. Do the rider first, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah. Right. That's fine. That's our squad wiped. Yeah. I wasn't sure whether I should. I was, I was half tempted to bring him across to shoot at the warriors. So there would have been a better chance of wounding. Bikes aren't as good as you think. No, I, I, I mean, I was that close to not using them anyway. But they, they look good, but when in this version, I don't. Unless we're just completely using them fucking wrong, I don't know, but. Yeah, it's. it's um, I, was, I think I should have been better off targeting them against the Warriors, but then you probably would have moved across and shot them anyway. Um, uh, him, full plus. Yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, bugger. You can fire. Yeah, two's to hit. That's cocked dice. Yeah, what are you going to target on? Well, I think it should be the. Yeah, okay, range. so I'll let you do your D12 malarkey. Yeah. So, it's so the one's got to point towards me. Uh, yeah, so what you do is you put the one towards me. Towards you? Uh, no, that, sorry, that one there. Yeah. yeah. And then you roll on the dice. Oh, like that? No, no. No, it's got, it's got the, the arrow's got to point towards... Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah,
All right, at least I'm not going to get tabled. <laughs> right. Combat, where do you want to start? Uh, we'll start with the Carnifix. <sighs> and we'll go against the Power Fist first. We can't. Why not? Choose. I yeah. suppose you can. Yeah, of course you can. So I charged. All right, two attacks. I've got... Uh, blah, 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 blah. I've got nine. Ooh. Ten, eleven. My weapon score is... Six. Charging ten, ten, eleven. So I'm going to have to parry that. Oh, 11. So your initial is higher than mine, so it would be one straight seven hits, so it's two's to wound. Seven is minus four, so it's a kill. That's a break test. Oh, they're not going nowhere. Right, I can't hurt you, so I'm just fighting to survive now. Not with that roll line. Uh, not with that roll line. Right, roll a couple of wound, mate. Uh, just roll a couple. As long as you don't roll a one. Yeah, he's dead. Right. Danny, come on, boy. He's got three attacks. Oh, four and nine. Yeah. Four, oh, four. Oh, two ones. No. I don't think I'm going to be... Charging still seven. Charging, Charging eight. eight. That negates one of them. Eight, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven. Oh, oh, twelve. Twelve. I've got seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Your initial is higher than mine. Two's the wound. Four plus save. Yes, so it blind it will flash out. Uh, so that's it. So basically on a four, five, or six, your kind of fix is blind. And your lictor. They're both blind. So your weapon skills technically will be one now. That's all right, it's the last turn. It's the last turn. Um, this oh, yeah, bad boy yeah. here. So you're gonna go against who first? I'll go against the normal gut marine. Normal marine. So you lose your charge bonus. Ooh. That's so seven. Eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine. And oh, no, I got four, five, six, seven, eight. Only one hit. Come on, roll a one. Roll a one. No, roll a six. Roll a six. Quite nice. nice. Oh, no, he's dead. Break test. Oh, no. That's done. Yeah, this is 30 here. Oh, yeah. 25%, isn't it? I'm all right. Right, so now I get two attacks, but on weapon skill of three. I got eight, nine. You got 13. So that's four hits. Oh. Yeah, what's your strength? That's oh, alright, it's it's three saves. Yeah, he's dead. And your two inch consolidation will do that. And that, sir, is the end. God! Do we need each of those those as well though? Don't send your ass. Yeah. Last turn. Definitely. Look at the state of me, man. That's that was <laughs> a hard that was a hard fight. Um <coughs> excuse me. So Bloody good fight. Thoroughly, I didn't realise it was that hard to fight against Nids. Uh, losing my heavy bowers like, like I did, like when he shot three off the board, that was a pain. But then they shouldn't have been there, the flamers should have taken them out. Very unlucky to take out the heavy bowers uh, with the other flamer units. But then not being able to fire because I failed my um, round check, so balanced out. Victory point. <coughs> God. Biscuit. Right, victory <laughs> points. <laughs> It was a draw. Yeah. 12 victory points each. One thing you got to be in mind, and Chase pulled me up on this, fair play to him because I didn't know. I just automatically, I split my tactical squad into five man squads. And it says in the Dark Millennium, you treat them as individuals then. So you either, when you kill three of that one five man squad, you get one victory point, And then when you wipe it out, you get the other victory point. You literally split the cost in half. Because of that, the Devastator squad, there was one left. Uh, if I'd done the points as a 10-man as a unit, yeah. it would have robbed Jason of a point. And because of that, it made it 12. But only because I failed two leadership tests. And if you had killed me commander, you would have won the game. Having said that, I feel you won the game anyway, because if you look at the victory points, Jason... <laughs> the table. <laughs> if you take away the uh, mission points that were earned. Mm. You got 10 victory points, and I only got six. The only yeah. reason I got 12 is because I had engage and destroy. And that's only because I took out your chaff and you kept throwing them at me deaf company. Yeah. Which was great. Just wanted to put them on the table. Because <laughs> my deaf company couldn't take out anything big, and I think I should have brought my bikes over at that side and just started rapid firing into your warriors. 
Because what that would have done is made your warriors turn around and shoot the bikes. Yeah. And then it would have saved my heavy bottles over there. So I should have. You would slowly would have taken out the chaff and the big stuff. No, no, I wouldn't have. I had nothing to do with. Well, you had a power fist in there, so all your other guys would take the hits while the big power fist was Yeah, but then the power down. fist would have done maybe one or two wounds. Yeah. All his mates would have been dead, and the carnivore would have been like that. Oh, right. no, because you've only killed one or two at a time. I don't think you would have done it, mate. Yeah, no, I think you would have. Already. The carnivore would have chomped through that devastator. Uh, that, uh, uh, death got me. I'd be surprised. I don't think you would have done so much, as much as you think you would have. Mate, what a game, though. Mm. What an absolute corker. So, um, yeah, ouch. Hard. And I got lucky with the event table as well. Yeah, yeah. Jones one, didn't blow up. Jones, well, no, you killed everybody. Yeah. So, didn't matter, did it? No. But yeah, the lictors are literally right on the edge of the board, and the corner fix is right over there as yeah. well. So and all I had to do was one more wound on your death company. One more wound on the death company would have left him with the chat room, which would have course, got you another victory point. And if you had killed the devastator over there, if we, you would, have, you know, yeah. Oh man, it was. But look, it's all your monstrous stuff left. Yes. None of your little guys are left. All your monsters are left. Yeah. Didn't touch him. I got a wound on one lick there. And that was it. Didn't touch the other stuff. I mean, I thought I might have got lucky with that carnivore with uh, the last cannon. Oh yeah. But you saved it. Rolled an eleven. I could have 2d6. I felt it in my bones. I was going to get the 10 to kill it. That would have been awesome. But there they go. But you only got 12 victory points. Yes. Yeah, but it's the first time I've ever used it to nids. Yeah, they're an hard army. I told you they're an hard army. Scary. Yeah. More last cannons needed, I think, or missile launchers. So I need to look into that. Get some missile launchers, even if it's the money posed ones. But then again, I took four, um, goggles because I thought, oh, yeah, goggles. But against Marines, it's all right. But next time, I'll probably say, no, I wouldn't take gold. I'll take some. <coughs> well, they're, they're, they're 192 points there. So if you got rid of them, yeah. you basically will get three Tired Warriors Bone Swords. Is that it? Yeah. In all fact, right. and that would be 195. Well, how much does Warriors with the um, Death Spears? A bit more. Well, yeah. actually, if you don't give them Bar Morphs, uh, they'd be 183 points. Oh, I'll do that. Take a squad of warriors with the bits. Death Death bits again. Yeah. No, well, I, I got, I got them. I'll have to strip them and paint them out for you then. Just that and firepower. For you. Take three marines out. Take three marines out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, devastating. Mm. Right, this is uh, probably a long battle because uh, when we filmed them, they were clocking in at about seventeen to twenty minutes each. Yep. So it's a long old game. Hope you made it to here. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Please. Please. And if you <laughs> want to buy a coffee. I'm not going to buy a coffee. Jace likes coffee. I like tea. Yeah. <laughs> but thank you for watching. Uh, we're we'll back next week. What time is it now? We'd like to let you know. It's now quarter to one. And we've been here since half six. Yeah. That's because we love you all. Yeah. Right. See you later, guys. Bye. See you, guys. Oh, and girls. Bye, Yeah, girls. <laughs>